Hi there, this is Raj Mathur from Cadence. This video is a feature highlight of Palladium Z1, Advanced Job Reshaping. To explain job reshaping, let's start with an analogy that we can all relate to. Remember Tetris? We've all played it at some point in our lives. You know the game with blocks of different sizes and shapes falling down and where you have to place the blocks in an optimal way to make full use of the available open spaces. Once the incoming rate of the falling blocks increases, you inevitably start to place them non-optimally and create holes in the build. At some point, you run out of luck and the game is over. Now, this Tetris game is an analogy to the task of submitting verification jobs to a verification compute platform in the acceleration and emulation space of EDA. Here, users build or compile their verification jobs and submit their jobs to a distributed resource manager, which queues up the jobs for submission into a verification computing platform. Now, traditionally, there's an efficiency delay in getting the jobs allocated to an available set of computing resources in a timely manner. Well, in this Tetris game of dispatching queued up verification jobs, the game's just gotten a little bit more interesting. With the next generation Palladium Z1 architecture, incoming jobs of variable sizes can be reshaped, allowing a more optimal placement in the verification computing platform. Here, we're showing a few examples of alternative shapes for a five domain job. Now what's more, the reshaping task is automated so you don't have to even think about how to reshape a job. So how does this work? Well, this matrix represents an eight by six set of logic domains in Palladium Z1 called a cluster. Each logic domain is essentially a massively parallel set of processing elements effectively executing 4 million gates of user logic. When a job is compiled for a set of domains on the Palladium Z1 engine, it assumes a certain physical shape. That shape is determined by the domains chosen by the engineer compiling the job. Let's take a look at dispatching a set of jobs waiting in a queue. Jobs are dispatched, a 16 domain job, followed by a nine domain job, then an eight domain job, a two domain job, and then another eight domain job. The next five domain job is L-shaped, but won't be able to fit in the available domains in the computing cluster, since the other jobs are still running. Now here's where the advanced job reshaping algorithm kicks in. The Palladium Z1 software automatically identifies alternative shapes for the five domain jobs. Once an appropriate shape fits the available domains, the reshaped job is then dispatched to the available domains in the verification computing platform. You don't have to lift a finger to reshape the job. At the end of the day, this game results in a constant high utilization of the computing platform. It creates the high score for you. To learn more, contact your Cadence Palladium sales team who are anxious to share this and other exciting features of Palladium Z1.